Hello YouTube friends, thanks so much for joining me today. I want to go over the colors that I'm using and uh, I am going to be doing a test. So today, right now, I'm going to be doing two different canvas with the same color, but one is going to be done with the house paint. I just used this artist loft bottle, but this is house paint, semi-gloss white or gloss white, gloss white, sorry. Um, I want to put in the same colors because I want to see how it's going to turn out. So I'm going to start and try to do it in the same um, order too. I'm going to start with Artist Left Matte Metallic Yellow. So I'm going to put a little bit right there. And let me clean up this. I'm making a mess in here. And let me put that over in the back. The next color is going to be Apple Ripe Tomato by Otis Loft. And I love this color, it's just so bright. Um, I really want to do a little bit more. Now, the size of my cans, as you can see, it's very small, it's 12 by 12. And um, I am so sorry, but I haven't been able to get my camera to work. The new camera that I told you all about. I'm not having much luck with it. So what I am gonna do is try to figure out how to use it and um, and then take it from there. Oh, I forgot to tell you, the gold color is, um, what's the name of that gold? It's, let me look. It's a very pretty color, guys. Astesa premium gold this is the one that i'm using i love this gold it's very very pretty and uh, the next color is apple tuscany red by otis loft and i'm just gonna put a little bit which i think might have been a little too much the next color i'm gonna do a touch of black literally like a little touch because i want to finish up with this black uh, and this is Otis Love Black, just simple, nothing special about it. And then I got done with this black. I'm not very fond of black, as you all probably already know. I'm going to put a little bit of gold on top of the black as well. And then a little bit, actually I'm just going to leave the gold on top of the black. I have enough red. And I'm gonna do the Amster, Amsterdam Titanium White. Before I do the Amsterdam Titanium White, I wanna get rid of the cells with the torch. Just because I don't want it to, once I start that, I need to work on it. And I meant get rid of the bubbles. I think I said get rid of the cells. <laughs> I have cells in my mind. Get rid of the bubbles. Let me make sure I have no bubbles. I should probably have done that on the white as well. I forgot about it. All right. I think I got it. Let me make sure I don't have any hair or anything on it. Nope. Now I'm going to put in the titanium white. And I'm going to be doing like one in the middle. Then I'm going to be doing like a little swirling. And a little bit more in the middle. And blow. So this one is going to be a little bit different than what I usually do. Alright, now I'm going to wait for a little reaction. Then I'm going to try, actually I can do it right now I think. 
Or should I just um, use the hair dryer? I just don't want to use the hair dryer because the hair dryer puts too much at once, too much pressure. So I'm going to just tilt it a little. Oh no, 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 no. Go back because I don't want to tilt it because then it's losing the cells. So I'm just going to try to blow it in, I guess. Let's see. Oh wow, that looks pretty. I'm gonna move a little bit backwards. Let's see, like that. Oh oh, I just got paint all over. I always do that. Ah. Now I'm going to put a little bit more white on top of this color there because I want to get the more cells. I just have to wait a little bit because I'm telling you guys. I'm not very good at blowing. I have this um, tool that I want to find where I put it, but I can't find it right now. Oh, wow. That's pretty. It's right there. Oh, yeah, right there. Actually, let me put the little white right on top of that, a little bit more white. So the next one I'm going to be doing with the um, blower. Should be a little tiny bit more like that. Yeah. There you go. Now turn it around. And I need to work a little bit more on that. Actually, you know what? Maybe not. like it like this it looks pretty I don't want to mess in these two sections here that looks so pretty Now I gotta put a little bit more house paint in this corner here because I just got it all over my shirt. And I'm always doing that. I love these colors together. They look so pretty. So I'm gonna be doing two, sorry about the noise, the background noise. I'm not sure if you can hear it. But I'm gonna be doing two sections. Ooh, I got, I touched the corner of my canvas and lost the paint. So let's see. Oh, sorry about that, guys. My phone is going crazy today. I got paint on my phone, too. That's great. Let me get this turned off. Yep, definitely need to turn this off. Oh, can turn it off. So, um, I'm going to be doing this week, guys, a video on the pieces that I have finished. 
Whoa, this is heavy. Wow, that looks so beautiful. Let me see if I can get it closer to you all. I almost don't want to put, well, I do and I don't want to put a little bit more white right there. I think I do. Let me just cover this up with house paint. I kind of like the house paint just because it's I make it so thick and it's so glossy. So let's see. I think I'm going to move a little bit more like right there. Let me see. If I put a little white in there. This white gives a lot of cells. So I want to move it right there. And then Oops. It just disappeared. <laughs> Oh yeah, right there. Now, I want to show up the colors over on this side. Yep, right there too. Okay, I think I like it like this, guys. I really do. I love how the reaction is doing. So let me torch a little bit and then I'm going to try to show it to you all. Just want to get rid of some bubbles and actually show a little bit more colors in here. Maybe right there too. Wow, it looks gorgeous, guys. Now there is a little thing, so when you're doing the, any type of art, you definitely need to have a tweezer with you because like there's a little piece right there that's too thick or I don't know why you did that, but I love this composition. So I'm going to show it to you all. Unfortunately, like I said, I haven't been able to figure out the video, so... I can't just bring the camera down because it's a computer, unfortunately, but I'm going to bring this to you. So just bear with me for a second. I don't want to make this video too long, but I want to be able to show you all. And I will do, like I was just starting to say, I, can, I think I didn't finish. I will do a video showing the last few pieces, the final results, so that you guys can see. The, my last video turned out just gorgeous it was really 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 nice so i want definitely want to show you that one and of course it was with my blues because i love my blues this one's a little bit out of my comfort zone with these colors because i'm not very fond of any other color other than blue but i had to do something different you know and it turned out beautiful so next I'm going to do a video, so if you are new to my channel, please subscribe, share, help me grow the channel. Uh, next, I'm going to be doing a video with the same colors, so it's the same paint, but I'm going to do a base with uh, Otto's Loft White. So if you watch this, please watch your, the next one as well. It's coming up the next couple days, and, um, and you'll be able to see it. And tell me which one you like the best. Like I said, this is with the house paint white. And I want to show you all. I can't show you too much because I can't tilt it. But this is how it turned out so far. So we'll see how it's going to dry out. I'm moving out of the way. So thanks so much for watching, guys. I appreciate it. God bless you all. Please subscribe, share. And um, I'll see you in the next video. Have a blast one.